can twerk. We are live, we are live. I go by name of Paula and today NBA 2K21 has put out a brand new game trailer. I think they sold us some dirt. I think it's gonna be the same game, but we're gonna watch the trailer. We're not gonna get copyrighted. I turned the music down, no volume, no nothing. Let's watch this. Niggas got the same scoreboard since last year. Wait a minute. Trying to pause. Niggas got the same scoreboard from last year. It looked like they modded a few people faces, but then I seen a video like a month ago. They said they didn't do nobody face game yet because of the virus. So the rookies might not be in the game because they didn't do the face game. We ain't have a real draft yet. It's gonna be some bullshit. We're gonna get through it though. Let's get through it. Shot clock looks the same. What the fuck? Hold on. I already can't shoot. You seen that meter? <laughs> it's like up here. I already can't shoot. Now I gotta dribble, mix the person in front of me, and then try to remember when I shoot, it's gonna pop over my head like this. I'm turning that shit off and I'm making a slasher. Nope. Dunking on everybody. Nah. What the fuck? That looks crazy. I don't get fooled, and you should not be fooled by these cinematic trailers they doing. That's the gap. That's the niggas putting the fake runs in the runs pack. That's the shit that say cornflakes, and they put it in the Kellogg's box. This shit look the same. Niggas just sweaty up. It looked just like the last game. You see a difference? It looked the same to you too? As long as you've been watching me play this game, you don't play 2K at all. But you've seen me play this game for like a good going on seven years. Right? What does it look like to you? So it look like the last one. That's an unbiased opinion. I got 2K eyes, so all this shit look the same. So a person who don't play 2K, that just watch this on TV. I see they changed the neighborhood up, but I'm not pre-ordering. I might get it for PC and mod the shit out of it. But other than that, you won't see me until PS5 playing against so I'm not doing this. This shit look the, the scoreboard is the same for the last two years. I don't trust niggas who don't change their scoreboard. So if you wanna waste money, that's on you. I'm not getting it on Xbox or PS4 because that's stupid. That's a waste of 60 or 70 dollars. To save that money, go do something else. Save it. PS5 coming in another three months and 90 days. You want to be one of the first people who get PS5. So I suggest you save your bread for that because PS5 and Xbox One going to cost mad money. You agree? So, you heard it here first. The trailer looked all right. If I never played 2K before, I'd be like, yo, this is fire. But I've been playing this shit consistently for years. We know the next year jump, or the next generation jump, gonna be crazy. The one with Zion, that's gonna be the game to get. This is just like, yo, I got leftover. Here, take this until the real shit come in three months. Like, so if you wanna waste your money, get this shit. I'm not pre-ordering. Don't make no difference. You gonna grind your my career player for 90 days. They told you in the trailer or every interview I've seen, 
Yo, it don't transfer over. So all your VC do. So you gonna grind man hard for VC. Or you could do that though. You could grind for VC with your player, and then when you get PS5, you can have enough to make three people, right? You could do that. So, but if you're willing to do that, cool. But ain't nobody gonna tell me straight up, yo, our main team is on PS5. Our other team is, so you got the B team, no disrespect to them. You got the, they don't care about putting out another one because the bomb is about to come in three months. So, that's my opinion on it. Thanks for watching. Like, share, comment, subscribe. We out of here.